tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Okay. Put it with the number. Okay. Ayan na. Number four. Ayan na. Omens. And means oh. death. Means death. Okay. So, dalawa ang opposite ng culture dito. Sa western, makikita mo yung mga captain ball ng basketball team. Di ba? Volleyball team. Four. Ang number. Four. No? Even in soccer or ano. But actually, they have parallelism. Four kasi, in Chinese, when you say it, it's like a uh, uh, C, no? Uh, death, no? And, uh, pag ginamit na, ito na yung number four man, or captain ball, yung sabihin, siya yung pinakamagaling, killer yan, you can die with this game, no? Pang patay ng other team. Kala. Okay? So, four is a number you normally evade, no? Unless it's combined with eight. So like in triple oh, numbers, success. if you ask, well, if it's uh, 148, it means luck and success. Okay? Oh. So, uh, pwede ka mag-presyo ng 148 for a hamburger. Okay? <laughs> so, or apply to your food, food products. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, okay. next number. Number seven, conflicts. Quarrelsome violence okay you know in feng shui there are cycles no we're now in the cycle they call period eight uh, prior to period eight it runs the cycle for that period uh, for each period is around 23 years in feng shui prior to that was period seven so during the period seven cycle seven was a lucky number it it used to be uh, symbolic, symbolic of protection. Uh, and aside from that, uh, man's lifetime, in, even in Western esoteric uh, beliefs, they measure man's lifetime every seven years. No? Uh, you grow up by uh, segments of seven years. And uh, also because of the protection. That's why during the time of President Marcos, his lucky and favorite num number was seven, and all cause number twenty-four. If you notice, also talking of jerseys, the uh, basketball jersey of Kobe Bryant is number twenty-four. So easy oh. death, no? Uh, easy death. Oh, oh. Ano ano ganon yon? Nagconfluence ang events na uh, he was year of the horse and. The year is year of metal rat, so he figured in a helicopter crash because horse is very unlucky during the year of the rat. The Plus, rat. Oh. Uh, he was I think going to a basketball game, presumably he was with that uh, jersey number, so uh, death. No? Okay, so next number please. Number 27, easy quarrels. Easy quarrels. No? So, same, no? Uh, two is easy, but again, there's a positive side. This is a very good number for lawyers. Okay? That's an <laughs> office address. Okay? Yes. <laughs> Madali silang kumita sa away. Okay? <laughs> Next number. Number 34, forever death. Ah, ito yung so, ano. Funeral uh, parlor din yan? <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. Uh, tsaka columbarium. Uh, maganda rin yan kung embalsamador ka. Yung karito mo. No? <laughs> Work from home pa, no? <laughs> May jersey siya, number 34. Okay, so be careful about uh, 34, forever dead. Was worse pa siya sa 2-4, okay? Oh, my. And, uh, magandang address na yan. Pag pinili sa Colum Columbari. <laughs> no? <laughs> Pag pinili ka nung uh, grid number 43. <laughs> Pero wag sa parking lot, wag sa home address, oh. wag sa business. Okay? Sa livingan, pwede yan. Okay? Lot number 43. Block 43, 
or crypt number 43. Okay? Yeah. Next. Ayan na. Address na ng kapatid ko. Double death. Ah, ano? Anong kapatid mo? A- address po ng kapatid ko, 44. Na- nakikinig ba siya ngayon? Nakikinig po siya ngayon, Master. Okay. Uh, yeah, double death. Normally, sa experience ko sa Feng Shui, those with addresses na may four, lalo na yung double four, nagkakaroon talaga ng double death sa bahay. Talikado. Lalo na kung uh, uh, 64 na yung address, tapos uh, tumbok pa no? <laughs> yung bahay. Diretsyo, talagang tatin. road. Oh, so, you can imagine kung may isang 6x6 delivery truck na wala ng preno, tuloy-tuloy sa bahay mo. Mag-crash. Okay. Uh, o kaya, nakatira ka sa Merville, uh, 64 bahay mo, tapos ginawa kang landingan ng uh, 747. <laughs> okay. Mag-crash yung aeroplano sa'yo. Okay. Uh, next number. Numbers. 67, the road to disharmony. Ayan. Kasi 7 nga is conflict. So, disharmony. Okay? So, normally, yung ibang Chinese, ginagawa yan. Pagka hindi nila type yung magiging balain nila, <laughs> or in-law, riregaluhan. Ganda pa ng townhouse iriregalo. Pero number naman, 67. Meron pa ng catch 22. Okay? So, ingat sa numbers na yan. Okay? Uh, next number? Number 70, fight over money. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, kasi zero is uh, money, seven is uh, conflict. Okay? Uh, next number? Number 71, fight over luck. Uh, may swerte, pero pinag-aawa yan ang swerte. Pinag-aawa no? Oo. Kaya ingat yung mga lotto winners. Ha? Maka biglang nanalo kayo, bumili kayo ng mansion, ng address number 71. Okay? Uh, mayaman nga kayo, wala namang peace yung buhay nyo. Okay? So, next now. Master, does this also apply for birthday? My son's birthday is 24 po kasi. Ah, no, oh, no. Oo nga, Master. Uh, this will not apply to uh, birthdays at all, no? Uh, don't worry, this is where uh, the saying in Feng Shui comes in. Uh, Feng Shui cures your destiny. So even if you go to a manghuhula, a tarot, or what, and they all say, so and so, you'll be a poor man, you'll be a pauper, or you'll be a prince. If you want to change all that, Feng Shui can balance your life and redirect it. Okay? So, that's that. It. Any other questions? Um, how about, from Miss Mary, how about 142 and 356 addresses? Oh, hi. Tingnan okay. ko yung student ko for tonight. Wali Victoria na to eh. <laughs> Tinsin, uh, you analyze. 142. 142. Um, Easy death to luck? Or no? Kasi ah, one yeah, is easy luck. Easy death to luck. Okay. Yes. So you teach her the cure for 142. You encircle the number 4 in your house. <laughs> so uh, number. With? Red. Uh, with? with red marker, pen, paint. Uh, or ink. No? Uh, ink. Kung gusto mong hindi halata, ball pen lang. Okay. Ball pen. <laughs> So, but the real business lesson behind all this helping and giving is one secret of merchants across millenniums of time. Magmula pa nung kay Adam and Eve, the first merchant, learned this lesson. Now, if there's a calamity like that, you have to help the community. That's your way of giving back for one simple reason. You have to protect your market. Okay? Pag nadapa yung area, patay, wala ka ng market. Well, your goods and services, you have nobody to sell. Whatever your field is, be you a politician, you're a social entrepreneur or political entrepreneur, you be a tycoon for all your beers, for all your uh, uh, grocery products, 
nobody will buy because they will not have the capacity to buy and patronize your product. Okay, so this is one also reason why um, chambers of commerce, especially the Filipino Chinese of chamber, chambers of commerce, are first always to help out in this type of uh, uh, disasters because there's one only merchant lesson there protect your market okay they can contact us sa, sa fb ig so ready heat go or you can just send me a message so my number is there and you can check our menu weekly so pabago bago siya it's not the same every week so i like your name huh? uh the business name ready heat yes, go so go. it's like ready eat go also after yes eat. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, very nice day. and good numbers. Okay. So with that, Tinsel, uh, uh, any parting words for our uh, uh, audience tonight, your classmates? Uh, uh, thank you po for having me here, and sana na natuto din kayo tulad ko na nag-enjoy ako sa sa session namin ni Master with the lucky and unlucky addresses. So, as for me, I know our Filipino audience are so uh, very enterprising and greedy to the point that they will even ask me, Pwede ba itaya to sa loto? Okay? <laughs> Actually, hindi lang po sa loto, pati sa Masyao. Okay? In Cebu. Okay? Um, Cebu is the, that's their lottery game there. No? Uh, Masyao and of course the uh authorized lot of uh, games no so with that uh, i hope you enjoyed your uh, we're over time na siguro uh, no. you, <laughs> yes you enjoyed your uh, learning tonight and uh, remember uh to tune in next week our lesson will be how to choose a business and it practically answers uh, what businesses can make you rich using Feng Shui uh, principles, okay? Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on Z81 Radio, Manila.